Hello everybody, my name is Kumaru, and welcome back to another episode of Wind Waker. It's been so, so long since I've been here. Uh, we had the Fairy Valley Virtual Furcon coming up, and I was organizing that, and just things were so busy. So I'm happy to get back into it and be back here with you guys. So we are in the middle of the Sacred Haven, the Forest Haven, excuse me, Forest Haven Temple. Um... I have no idea what we just got. I have no clue. I don't remember a damn thing. So this should be fun. Uh, let's see. So I think that was the main goal of going this way. Let's see. I think that was the main goal of going in here was to get what was in there. Like, I literally don't remember what we were doing or where I was. So this will be interesting. All right, so where were we? Oh, that's right. Hello. No. Really? There we go. So, am I able to get all this back down here? No, we dropped down here. I just didn't remember. What am I? Hello? There we go. What? Uh, I guess we have to go back up here. But no, it's super. I'm super happy to be back. We had a great uh, fur con. Everything went super, super well, and I really enjoyed myself. Um, I missed making uh, Wind Waker videos. I really did. So it's it's good to get back into it. And plus, you know, this this is always a nice way to relax. To be honest with you. It's a little loud on my end, so let me see if I can turn that down a little bit. Let's see. Here we go. I know that's, yeah, it's probably right about the right uh, volume. Hello. Nope. Shoot me. Nope. That's what you get. That's still super loud on the on the mixer. So let me bump that down even more for you. There we go. Now it's not overbearing. Ooh, Jesus. I don't remember what those things do if they catch you. I don't want to find out. Oh, we're here to get the big key already. Awesome. And do we have a thingy? No? I don't remember. Thought we'd have a fight. Nope, instead we get to come up here and get to demonstrate the best part of this boomerang. And there it goes. Wait, what? What? Excuse me? What are you looking at? Oh! Let's see. Um, let's do that. Let's get up here. Or no question mark? Yep. I literally thought that was what you were supposed to do with this. Hold on, let's try this again. Oh wait a second. Here we go. Thank you, thank you, Link. Yeah. There we go. I was about to say. I thought that was how you were supposed yeah. to do it. You have to like start it on one side of that tree. That way it actually makes it all the way around. And we got the big key. Use it to gain entrance to the room where the dungeon boss lurks. Awesome. <coughs> there they are. I still don't know what, what to equate that sound to. Get out of here. Uh, I tried to block you. Oh, 
here, bitch. Uh, wh where was my fucking... Oh, uh, what? Just get out of here. You're not dead yet. Okay, you're dead. No, you're not. Now you're dead. Okay. One more? There we go. That took longer than it should have. Now we can get up there. And here we get another necklace. Some hearts. Another necklace. You want to collect these necklaces at all costs. Like, they're, they're really important for one of the side quests that you're going to have to do. Which, I want to do as many of the side quests as I can without, uh, you know, feeling too overwhelmed by all the extra stuff. Because the story is so good on its own, like, you really don't have to do any of the side quests, but I like doing them, so. Just some of them are really tedious. It's not as bad as Gold Skulls was, like, that's like the Picto Box one, and I don't like the Picto Box side quest. Get out of here. Okay. Yep. Went that way, yeah, we did. So we have to go back this way, right? Question mark. Um, like I said, I don't remember anything that we did. So, excuse me, can we try that again? I'm missing something here. Yeah, let's try this. Oh, that was it. Fuck. There we go. There's that. Oh. Oh, hello. Okay. Fuck off. I don't like these stupid things, to be honest with you. Oh! <laughs> That's never happened before. Like, that has never happened before. That was funny. And we get another joy pendant. Slay the flock to those who spread joy like butterflies and connect filled blossoms. Uh, we came in that other way, so this way. And here's the boss door. Do we still have that fairy? We do. Awesome. So yeah, so we, I think we can just go right into it. I mean, you can break some of these, see what you get here. See, but some of them have that, those in them. All right, let's do it. Boss battle time, baby! I do not remember this boss one bit. Oh wait, yes I do. It's my car. Hey, buddy. Oh my god, no. So he ate my car. That bastard. Oh, that was a bad idea. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, more. Oh, I thought I would get two in. Apparently not.
fuck. Ah, run away. Boss music is so loud in this game. Holy shit. Got one more. Got it. Yeah, I'll let him meet me again. Just to get that extra hit in there. Oh, fuck. Um... Hearts. Hearts, please. Yes, please. I think I got one more. Jesus. There we go. I put my fucking sword away right at the end. Figures. But we got him. There's my car. Poor boy. Good job, Link. You did it. Sportsman, are you the one who rescued me? You have my thanks. When all went dark around me, I thought my time on the earth was over. But why are you here, Swordsman? What? The Great Deku Tree sent you? Oh, th that's right. Today is the day of our annual ceremony. Oh, I'm in trouble. I shouldn't be here. I must get out of here immediately. Damn right you're in trouble. I guess it forces you to take this heart container, so if you wanted to do like a three heart run, I guess you couldn't. Unless there's a way to skip it, which I'm sure there probably is. And we get teleported off. And the car comes with us. That's really an easy boss fight. I made that look a lot harder than it, than it really is. There's not even any phases to it. Mm. Oh, my car, you have returned safely. I'm sorry, Great Deku Tree. I know you warned us many times, but still I did not listen. Do not worry, Makar. You are safe now. Just be more careful from now on. You have done well, Link. I must thank you for your brave deeds. Here is that which I have promised you. Please accept it. And he's... There it is. We've got Pharaoh's Pearl. The Earth Spirit, the Deku Tree, has seen fit to give you this jewel, a treasure of the goddess Pharaoh. It is my hope that this pearl shall lead you to a fair destiny. All is well, Makar. Do not cry. Please, play your songs for me as you always do. Oh, that's right! We must begin our ceremony soon before the day ends! I'm sorry to keep you all waiting. Let the ceremony begin! He's a cello. Or viola. I don't know. You can't tell the exact size of it. As my thanks to you, I shall play even harder than I normally do. I hope you enjoy it. I love the music. Yes. You guys can't see it, but I'm nodding my head to the song. I love it. Deku Seeds! There they go! <laughs> oh, 
great deco tree this year, you have once again produced some splendid seeds. With these seeds, we will continue to spread new forests across the great sea. Let us go, Koroks, to the sea. See you all next year. Take care. Farewell, great swordsman. May the winds of chance bring us together again someday. And off they go. And that is actually a side quest, finding all of them. Makar, you're so cute. Can we speak to the Great Deku Tree? I think he'll tell us about it. Every year after the Koroks perform this, this ceremony, they fly off to the distant islands on the sea and plant my seeds in the hopes that new forests will grow. Forests hold great power. They can change one tiny island to a much larger island, much larger land. Soon a day will come when all the islands are one, connected by earth and grove, and the people who live on that great island will be able to join hands and together create a better world. Such is my dream. But the one you are chasing is trying to prevent that dream from ever coming to pass. Link, already your fate is tied to the fate of this world. You must proceed with great care. Yee. What's up, Makar? Thank you, Link, for all that you've done for me. How was my performance? Did it suit your taste or no? Absolutely. This instrument is the one the great Deku Tree gave to me on the day of my birth. He said it's an instrument that people played long, long ago. It has taken many long hours of practice for me to be able to perform at the level I do now. Eight of my fellow Koroks have set out on journeys to create new forests in the world. But both Hollow, who studies the making of potions, and I are always on this island. Please come to see us here again. We'll be waiting for you. So, before I end this video, I do want to go talk to Hollow, who is up here. <coughs> What's up, Hollow? Swordsman, thank you so much for bringing Makar back to us. I am Hollow. I make potions from the fruits of the forest. I wish I could create a potion that would help you, Swordsman. But the ones I have here only seem to work on my fellow Koroks. I know! If you could somehow gain magic power, Swordsman, then you will surely need a potion that can replenish it. Then, if I can get the right ingredients, I might be able to make a potion for you. Oh, but I haven't seen the ingredients that help recover magic power here in the forest. If I had seeds from the flower monsters in the Forbidden Woods, then maybe I could make a potion for you. Do you know about those seeds? Uh, matter of fact, I do. Oops. Oops. We show these to him. Oh, that's that's a Bokubama seed. That's it. That's what I need to make the kind of super su super replenishing potion that would help you, Groot Swordsman. Oh, but I can't give you any potion if you don't have an empty bottle to carry it in. I'm sorry. Yeah, I have a fairy, and I really don't want to lose my fairy right now, so we are good. <coughs> Let's get out and talk to the King of Red Lions and uh, kind of give us a prelude to where we got to go next. I could sit here every, like just all day listening to my car play. I know it's the same track the whole time, but I love it. And away we go! Whoa! And there's the fish. Whoop! Nope. Oh, if we, we have a mail. Good evening! Letters for Link, we have one letter. Here is your letter. Dear Link, if you are reading this letter, it can only mean you have peeked into one of our many post boxes. I am indebted to you. I am very sorry I let you leave without thanking you. Please accept my heartfelt apology along with my thanks. We cannot do much to help you, but we can at least do this. If we get any letters or parcels to you, we will deliver them to a post box near you. If you see any wiggling post boxes, please look inside them. I suppose you have a long way to go before your perilous journey is done. I have included a gift for you with my letter in the hope that it might help you. Please accept this small token. I look forward to the day that we meet again. May fortune fill your wings from Kamali's father. Awesome! And we got a piece of heart! Awesome! So that's our second piece. So I will get a lot of the piece of hearts because it makes the game a little bit easier. I'll get most of them. But uh, then we'll you know, kind of focus on some of the other side quests. So this place, too, has been attacked by Ganon. Could he already be regaining his power? Link, you must get the remaining pearl. It lies in a place northwest of here. We must set sail immediately. And we will do that next time. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed us beating this dungeon and uh, getting Feroar's pearl. 
um, yeah, so next time we'll go get the last pearl, and then we will see what happens next. I don't want to spoil anything. Um, just so you guys know, uh, we do actually have a Discord channel. If you guys do want to join that, there will be a link down in the description below. If you did like the video, please be sure to leave a comment, like, and subscribe if you guys did want to see more. Um, I'm always going to be answering questions down in the comments, so if you guys have any questions, please let me know. If you have any specific side quests you want me to do, please let me know. Um, other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Kumaru. I've been recording this for Furry Valley, and I love you guys so much. Thank you so much. I'm glad to be back. And, yeah, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.